the EST of WWE. And from Knoxville, Tennessee, the Raw Women's Champion, Bianca Belair. Hey, Bianca, make such a confident entrance. Let's be honest, it's because Bianca Belair realizes exactly how great she is. Uh, uh, um, Corey, not just great, the greatest. Get it? Listen to this ovation. The WWE Universe loves cheering on the EST. Well, oh, come on. Her energy is just infectious. I'd see Graves even dancing over there. Uh, I'm not sure I'd call that dancing. Yeah, Becky Lynch has had to overcome countless challenges in her career, both in and out of the ring. You know, she's the first female competitor to hold two world titles at the same time. Well, you could say that Becky Lynch has carved out a Hall of Fame career simply because she has believed in herself every step of the way. Look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? She has been counting the weeks, the days, the minutes until this match, and she is now ready to compete. I still wonder why she's just so unpleasant, so hostile all the time. Go well, maybe you should just mind your business, Saxton, because you're talking about the first and women's go. Grand Slam champion, the first women's Triple Crown winner. And not only is Bailey physical in the ring, but she can uh, beat you mentally as well. Yeah, Bailey's new attitude was very upsetting for fans who had supported Bailey for years. You include yourself in that group, Saxton, because I find it apropos when Bailey calls you an idiot. She doesn't mean it, does she? Oh, yeah. She certainly knows how to get a reaction, and she'll get an even bigger one when she wins this match. Here 
comes trouble. A superstar who is always ready for a fight. And she won't let anything stand in her way. And representing Damage Control from Auckland, New Zealand, Takunda Kai. This is a woman who demands her place in the spotlight and has taken it by pure force. You know, it's hard to think at one time Dakota Kai was the captain of Team yeah, King. at one with... time, Byron, at one time. That included the entire WWE Universe, but how things have changed. Dakota is no longer the captain of Team Kick. She's the leader and the ruler of Team Kick. And Saxton, you're on. Control. And representing Damage Control from Tokyo, Japan, Io Sky. An NXT Women's Tag Team Champion, a Dusty Classic winner, NXT That's Women's it. Champion, and multiple time WWE Women's Tag Team Champion. Yeah, there was truly no limit to the future success of Io Sky, especially with Damage Control by her side. Well, lover or hater, Sky has one of the best moonsaults in all of WWE. You're right about that, Saxon. If we're lucky, we'll see another one tonight. The genius of the Sky about to assert control. She held the women's title for 649 days. And in NXT, she won the Dusty Rhodes Classic alongside Io Sky. No matter what brand she's on, her name is always in the title picture. A woman descended from generations of warriors. Fighting is in her blood. And there is fire in her eyes that cannot be extinguished. Glasgow, Scotland. One half of the NXT Women's Tag Team Champions, Alan Dawn. Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have wanted to call this match. I cannot wait to finally do it. The champ knows that a big win tonight sends a message to all of the top contenders. herself, Cole. She's not up and coming. Indy believes she is already main event worthy. And from Melbourne, Australia, the NXT Women's Champion, 
Indy Hartwell. Pretty cool fact here. Indy began her in-ring career at just 19 years old. Or how about this, Michael? Indy Hartwell made her NXT and main roster debuts by the age of just 23. I had my first match at 16. Where are my flowers? Why does no one talk about me? You guys are biased. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, war, hall, low, at a combined weight of 552 pounds, Eric and Ivo, the Viking Raiders. Take a look at this team, completely on the same page. Such incredible teamwork they've shown. I can't wait to see them compete. the WWE Universe has expected a classic. I think it is destined to deliver. This is a match she has long been asking for. She is more than ready to compete tonight. And their opponents, Max Z Duke P, at a combined weight of 489 pounds, Marseille and Mansoir, maximum male models. College wrestling legends, but there's no sportsmanship on display tonight. The Steiners are here to beat people up and enjoy every second of it. Buckle up, someone's getting tossed around. A tag team equally built for wrestling and a good old-fashioned fight. Detroit tough, next-level power, and unmatched in-ring stamina. And women's 
independent wrestling, Zoe Stark. Now looking to prove herself in WWE. And their opponent from Utah, Zoe Stark. This is a tough, tough woman. No doubt, Zoe Stark, one of the hardest hitters in the women's division, also battled back from a devastating torn ACL to reestablish her spot in NXT. She calls herself undeniable, well, it's time to prove it. I have every bit of confidence that she will. Here comes the boat of WWE. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, no! Well, Natalia represents a dynasty of sports entertainment. Come on, let's go! She mastered the sharpshooter in the heart dungeon, and she's looking to unleash it tonight. Natalia's got tremendous power and aggression. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring, accompanied by B Fan at a combined weight of 539 pounds. Ashanti Adonis and Top Dollar. You are looking at a very, very intelligent and street smart crew. Yeah, Hit Row looking to put the tag team division on notice. Believe they're a certified threat. Well, in my opinion, Cole, they've already proven it. Here's a crew who relies on smart leadership and plenty of athletic talent. All the elements of an elite tag team unit. Careful how you speak about Sonya Cole. She happens to have a very gifted mind for this business, both as an official and from bell to bell. Disciplined, driven. In fact, the day that Sonya Deville graduated high school, she packed up her car, drove down to South Florida, and began training full-time in mixed martial arts.
tell you one thing, I don't think I've ever seen a more self-centered superstar in my time here in WWE. Well then, Byron, you've clearly never seen the WWE oh! Hall of Fame. Hey, everyone in the Hall of Fame has a reason to have an ego. This superstar, they haven't earned it just yet. Oh! She knows she deserves to be atop this division, and a win tonight will go a long way towards that. Yeah, like her or hate her, Lacey is as tough as they come. Evans is no longer asking for respect. She's going to beat the respect out of every woman on the roster. Who's going to stop her? <laughs> 